next few minutes, we will dive deeper into one of the oldest pan-Indian dance styles, men's traditional southern straight. straight dancer wears bicycle shorts and an undershirt in order to easily layer himself. The first step in getting dressed includes a breech cloth and tie-up buckskin leggings. The leggings attach directly to the breech cloth belt. <laughs> drops are tied around the waist. All the ribbon work on both side drops and the breech cloth are special to each dancer. shirt is put on the dancer, grabs his bandolier made of bone and elk teeth, and a cloth sash. The dancer strategically places his beaver fur backdrop and scarf evenly down the center of his back. Every dancer has objects important to them on their regalia. Listen as Justice tells you about his. An object that holds a lot of significance on my regalia is this pouch. This was the pouch that was gifted to me when I was elected the Nantscope Lenape Tribal Warrior, and it has our tribal symbol of a turtle on it and a medicine circle. Um, but this, this symbol isn't just specific to our tribe, it is also a sacred symbol across Native America. And whenever I put it on, I have to do such in prayer that I will represent my people well. 
Second thing I also have is the pouch that was gifted to me when I was elected the, the Tribal Junior Warrior. Um, both these positions act as youth ambassadors to the tribe, and it is always an honor to represent my tribe and to be able to symbolize the youth of my people. And the last item is something that my parents got me. It's a carved wolf out of bone. It's a bone necklace. Um, it, it's very special to me because my tribal ceremonial name is Leaping Wolf. And so this item in particular, it really means a lot to me. As he's finishing up, he ties his buckskin moccasins to secure his feet. Lastly, the dancer wears a porky roach made out of porcupine guard hair and deer tail fur. <laughs>